Alright, so what's up guys? Welcome back for another skin review for DK. Uh, I actually kind of held off for a good while. I was, I was supposed to do one for last month, which was supposed to be including uh, Tia, Naga, and... Oh, Marciana, that's right. Oh, that was actually a really good skin, hell yeah. But yeah, man, so welcome back. So before we get started, like the video, say nothing in the comments, and subscribe. Because it makes your butt cheeks look a lot more shinier than they already are. And who doesn't like having super shiny butt cheeks? On that baby, hey man, let's get into it. But yeah, so we do have quite a few skins to cover because actually this time I'm going to be covering fucking um the three skins we got from the collab, which is the Ev uh, Evangelion, the suits we got with that one, uh, including Leona's skin. So we got quite a bit to cover. So let's go and get straight into it. So the one thing I'm going to be starting off with is actually a Tia skin. Uh, this one was from last month. We got it for free. Overall, it's it's a pretty nice looking skin. Don't get me wrong, it, it does look okay. Like it's. I mean, really can't complain. It was a free skin, just not really something I really gave a shit about. But fucking, um, I mean, that, I mean, it is a pretty good looking skin. There's, I mean, it's very casual, very simple. It's just, I, I don't know. It's not really my cup of tea. But I mean, I do know that there are some people who like Tia, and she does have some massive jugs. But overall, I mean, the skin's just, it's kind of just there, man. It's really nothing too impressive. Again, if you like Tia, a hey, you got a free skin. Um, overall, it's just, it's just kind of there um, in terms of the shooting animation. Yeah, I mean, it's still just as tasteful as the original, so. I don't know about this. I would definitely prefer over the original, though. But, yeah, I mean, there isn't really much to say about this skin. So, let's go and move on to the next one. Whereas, the next one that we're going to be covering is Naga skin. Alright, now, if you heard my thoughts before, you know I'm not really a big fan of Naga. I really, I just, I don't, just not really my cup of tea. But, overall, I mean, we're just here really to talk about the skins. The, I mean, it is a pretty... I mean, putting my bias to the side, it actually is a pretty good looking outfit. It does look pretty nice. And then, of course, you know me, I, I always buy the skins just because to get, to get the bonuses. Even if it's for a character I really don't feel like using. But for the most part, I mean, it's, it's a pretty decent looking outfit. Uh, the animation is just a little bit different from what she originally had. But overall, I mean, yeah, it's pretty nice. It's all pinkish. I don't know, I feel like it's probably a dress an old lady would wear, but I mean, it's, well... <laughs> In terms of like the, the like the hem like right here and stuff like that, not, not the rest of it showing the cleavage, <laughs> but overall, I mean, yeah, it's it's a pretty cool looking skin. It's nice. I mean, it's just really there. It's Naga, and I know there are some people who do like Naga, so I'm pretty sure they'd be satisfied satisfied with the skin. So next up, the next one we actually have, well, actually, you know, I was just showing her off right now, is Marciana, and damn, big ass fucking nut. But overall, this again is a very tasteful skin. Uh, one thing this kind of reminds me of, it kind of reminds me um, of actually quite a few, a couple of skins from Magellane. I believe I'm thinking about is uh, the one for Shimakaze, and I can't remember the other girl, but... Oh, uh, um, Goldenheim, there you go. Yeah, but I don't know, like, they made Mar Marciana look fucking good in this one. Like Originally, I wasn't too fond of it. I was like, you know what, it, it eventually grew on me. I'm like, you know what, I, I gotta show the money off for this one. It's, it's a good-looking skin, like, hot damn, like... And Marciana is pretty high up there for me in Elysian, like, damn. But overall, it's a very good looking skin. I mean, it, the main focus is just Marciana. Uh, I'm definitely liking the uh, the colors. Well, it's it's not it's not the colors, but the, the lighting effects that are around her, like through the mirror and stuff like that. Got like a little bit of hazy light going on right here. A broken lamp. <laughs> but I'm assuming that's probably story related or something like that. Uh, there's some pictures I'm assuming of some of her students, but we really can't see them too well. Overall, it's a pretty good looking skin. I, I honestly do like the way it looks. And again, it's Marciana, so it, it looks fucking sexy. Like, hell yeah. So, the next one we're going to be covering is the one for the collab units, which was for um, uh, Ray, Asuka, and Madi. So, let's go and check out Asuka first. Let's see. Okay, okay I actually kind of invested into her a little bit. So, first of all, this is her, her new the outfit that she got with the pass, which is called the Cynical Street. Uh, overall, it's a pretty cool looking skin. I mean, nothing too tasteful, but I don't know. I actually kind of like the way it looks. It looks pretty cool. Also, like this little detail where she kind of like sticks her tongue out a little bit. I don't know. It's just, just kind of making her seem like, I don't know, like just kind of being a little menace or just being kind of like a bitch. I don't know. But overall, it's pretty cool. I like the little background too. This is what I really wish Nikkei would throw in more. It's like little backgrounds like this where she's like standing in front of a shutter, like in spray cans and shit like that. But overall, thing, again, I actually don't know anything about Evangelion. Um, if anything, that thing's probably just as old as I am. Uh, you know what? I'll probably throw on a side note. Just I, I don't even know. How, actually, I don't know how old Evangelion is. I mean, I'm 1980. I don't even know when Evangelion even came out. 
Um, as long as it's been around, I've never checked it out. But yeah, I'm going, I'm going on a side note. But yeah, I mean, overall, I mean, it's a pretty decent outfit. I do like the way it looks. Uh, I don't, I, actually, I kind of like it better than the, the default that she has. Which is funny, because usually skin suits are kind of sexy. But I don't know, I kind of like this one. It looks pretty cool. But let's see, let's go on to the next one. So, oh, you know what? That's right. They, we technically got two, which is the free one. Uh, now, the only thing I do know about Evangelion is this is the school outfits they do wear. Because, I mean, I've seen some videos that briefly talk about it. So, I've, I've seen scenes where they're in their school outfit, and that, that's their school outfit. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's there. It's nothing too special. I'm pretty sure everyone's seen it. But let's go on to the next one. So, next up, we have Ray, And for her outfit, she's got the Peaceful Vacation. Uh, actually, I, I, I will say I actually do like the skin. It's a very pretty skin. Um, a little bit of see-through, which is kind of sexy, but I don't know, Ray herself, Ray herself is just not really, like, I mean, she's alright, like, she, she gets, she kind of gets a nut, but, I don't, I don't know, I, I do like, I do like, I just like the, I just like the dress look, it looks pretty nice. Uh, background's very basic and simple, just standing in front of a plant, just a nice chest with some water bottles inside. But overall, I, mean, I actually do like the way the skin looks, that's actually what I'm using, is I, I like the way it looks. It's a very pretty outfit. Uh, then we got the school outfit, which again, just... Very basic schoolgirl alpha from Evangelion. Cool, don't really care for it, but hey, I mean, it's there. If you like it, you like it. Shit. Let's see. Oh, oh wrong button. Shit. Alright, so let's go on to the next girl. Next up, we're gonna have is Madi. Let's see. Yeah. Well, right off the bat, I mean, I definitely prefer the skin suit for Madi, and Madi actually looks pretty damn sexy. Like, damn, big ass fucking nut. So if I ever do watch Evangelion, I'm definitely gonna wanna keep an eye on her. But yeah, so the, the first one we have is actually quite different from the other ones. I'm assuming that's the school uniform, well it does say school uniform, but I mean it's there, it's nice, I mean I guess. I mean school, I don't know, school uniforms just really aren't my thing, but I, a lot of people seem to like it for some reason, just it's there and she still looks pretty good, but I mean it's a free outfit, so I mean why the hell not. But this one right here, this one, I mean it's alright, it's nothing too special. Like when I first saw the top, I was kind of thinking like, not like a prisoner's top or something. <laughs> but this one, I, I do like the background. I'm just not too fond of the costume itself. Again, I definitely prefer the bodysuit. That one actually looks pretty damn nice. But, you know, so the very basic background just looks really cool. The, the different various colors right here. Soft colors. Crab, seashell. It looks pretty cool. Overall, it's a pretty nice looking skin. Just not one I'm going to see myself using. But let's see. Alright, so that's pretty much Molly. So the last one on the list is going to be for Leona, I believe. Let's see where she at. Here we go. Alright, so, I mean, you know me, I'm not exactly a fan of Leona, but I will say the outfit actually does make her look pretty good. Um, like, damn, I mean, well, then again, there's kind of one specific reason that might change my mind a little bit. But compared to her default, I mean, it does look pretty nice. Like, okay, I'll give her that. It looks pretty good. But, and that's kind of funny. They gave Timmy here, like, a little visor. <laughs> Just like, what the fuck? He's even got, like, a helmet on and shit, but... We all know what we're looking for over here, like, if it ain't obvious, she's got the cake, she's got the assets, man. Uh, again, still not, not my thing, but, I mean, I will admit, okay, it does look a little nice, but, again, no, man, I'm just not a fan of waifus with tattoos, but that's not what we're here to talk about. Overall, the outfit looks pretty good, um, in terms of, like, trying to be, like, Evangelion style, I mean, yeah, it actually does look pretty nice. Uh, definitely makes her look a little bit more sexier, I guess, so I'm pretty sure some people will really be liking that. Uh, even though I hate to say it, I mean, she's probably, like, the only good-looking member of Happy Zoo or whatever the fuck they're called. But, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much all I really wanted to talk about was just the skins. Um, I do know there is more, but, again, I'm going to wait until they actually come out. So, that's going to be the one for Tuve. Um, who else is there? Actually, it's just Tuve and... Oh, Miranda. I, I do know about Miranda. But, again, I'm going to wait for those to come out. Then I'll eventually, I'll eventually cover those. It's just a, l a little weird thing of mine that I had to do where... And unless the character's playable and the skin is out, then yeah, I'm, I'm not going to cover it. But, I'm like, I mean, that's really all I really wanted to talk about. Uh, one thing I will be doing, too, is doing some more nut ratings, which will probably be for a, a good portion of the characters we just covered, which, of course, is Abnormal. And um, I'm trying to remember what other characters we got. Well, yeah, you know what? That, that collab lasted for more than a month, so I, I don't remember who else we got, actually. I would have to go back and check it out. But, uh, you know, that's, that's pretty much where I'm ended off right there, you know, just to do my usual bullshit. You know, just to reiterate, like the video, say nothing in the comments, and subscribe because it makes her butt cheeks look a lot more shinier than they already are. On that, man, hey, man, thanks for watching. Night.